Now it's time for our video pick of the week, and I would like to recommend a strange and funny horror satire named Evil Dead 2, Dead by Dawn. I said earlier in the program that I was disappointed by its sequel, Army of Darkness, the Sam Raimi horror spoof that has great production values, but somehow seems to be recycling its comedy approach. Maybe that's because I was a fan of Raimi's 1987 movie, Evil Dead 2, which also starred the hard-working Bruce Campbell as the bloodiest self-defense artist in horror history. Groovy. Evil Dead 2 is not for everyone, but for horror fans, it's one of the funniest movies of recent years. I recommend you take a look at it on home video. Now let's take another look at the movies we reviewed this week. A split decision on falling down with Michael Douglas as an unemployed worker on a rampage. I thought it struck a nerve. Gene thought the same story had been done earlier and much better. Two thumbs down for The Temp, a movie that disappears into an impenetrable thicket of murky plotting. Two more thumbs down for Army of Darkness, the horror film send up that never really takes off. And so my recommendation, go see The Crying Game. That's it for this week. We'll be back next week with reviews of Mad Dog and Glory with mobster Bill Murray giving timid police investigator Robert De Niro a very unusual present.